Students in Coconut Grove are turning back to class today, one day after gunshots hit an elementary school. Now, thankfully, no one was hurt. Local 10 News reporter Ben Kennedy is live outside of Francis S. Tucker Elementary School, where that shooting took place. Constance, kids are still talking about what happened on Thursday. Many were scared, cowering underneath their desks. This is the scene here behind me, beyond this metal fence. That is where a bullet went through a window in that portable classroom in the distance, which is empty today. Class is back to normal at Francis Tucker Elementary School in Coconut Grove. One day after shots were fired, at a bullet pierced a window of a portable classroom. Even though the bullet did get through, nobody got hurt, and that's the most important thing. I was sitting at the front table. Ten-year-old Tavares Williams Jr. saw a bullet land a foot from his best friend. We waited for the police to come, then we left and went to another classroom. When he panicked like that. He, he can't get no oxygen. Nobody was telling me what was going on. Officers say someone pulled the trigger two blocks away and a stray bullet hit a window of a classroom. This is the second shooting outside of Miami Dade Public School in a 24 hour period, and Superintendent Alberto Carvalho is fed up. When chance and luck are our children's best friends in this community, something is broken. Police were back at the scene on Friday as parents walked their kids to class, some sharing this message. Just told her to be safe and just try to treat it as a normal day. And by all means, it is a normal day here. I spoke to the principal moments ago who said they will not be having class at this portable unit behind me as they start to clean up all that damage. And so far, no one has been arrested for this violence. Reporting live in Coconut Grove, Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News.